Hey guys, welcome to a new Biker Geek video. If you're like me and you're planning on upgrading your system in the coming weeks or months, maybe you're even thinking of switching from the blue team to the red team, then you might want to hold on to your money for now at least, because AMD just announced some significant news that might just influence how much you spend and how you spend it. If you hadn't heard, AMD just launched a couple of budget range 3000 series CPUs, those being the new 3300X and the 3100. They're both four core, eight thread CPUs with a maximum boost of 4.3 gigahertz on the 3300X. They both have a sizable level three cache as well as a decent TDP to boot. Now, I've been having a look around on Amazon UK today and they have both of these CPUs listed up for sale. The 3100, is selling for just £99 and the 3300X is a little bit more at £115. This is absolutely incredible value for what you're getting. All the performance indicators I've seen suggest these are pretty impressive CPUs. So if you're in the market for a budget CPU, then I'd make one of these a choice on your shopping list. And if you've got the extra money available, then it's well worth considering spending a little more to get the 3300X in my opinion. One thing you need to note however is that compared to previous budget CPUs these don't come with built-in graphics so if you're lacking a dedicated GPU then you'll need to factor that into your pricing. What's interesting about these new CPUs is that whilst they will work on the X470 and B450 motherboards they also work on the new B550 boards. Yes, that's right, there's a new chipset coming in June with enhancements over the B450 platform. As you can see here, it's mainly a shift to the next generation of things like PCIe and USB, but it's also got the added extra bonus of dual graphics support. So why the new chipset? Well, AMD published its roadmap for its CPUs going forward. And what you're seeing here is that AMD just shifted their architecture with the introduction of Zen 3. So for people like you and me, we now have an interesting decision to make as there's some definite crossover going on here. Unfortunately, the chart only goes as far as the B550 chipset, but you can clearly see that AMD don't intend to support 2000 series CPUs or 3000 series with built-in graphics on this chipset. Of course, this is only AMD's official supported list and it's entirely possible that motherboard manufacturers could offer support for Zen 3 in the existing X470 and B450 platforms. At this point in time though, your guess is as good as mine as to whether that will happen. With the new CPUs due out in May and the new B550 based board in June, if you are planning to upgrade anytime soon, especially if the lockdown is driving you crazy and you're needing something to do, then you might be better waiting until June. Of course, you could just go ahead and buy an insanely priced X570 board now, but with the new B550 board due out in just over a month from major manufacturers such as ASRock, Asus, Biostar, Gigabyte and MSI, I think it's a good bet to hold off until then to see what comes out and at what prices. But indicators at the moment are that those prices won't be far off current B450 boards. Either way, the X570 or B550 will make good future-proof boards if you're looking to upgrade as AMD moves forward with its 4000 series CPUs. Anyway guys, hope you enjoyed the video and found it useful. I'll leave links in the description to the new CPUs and feel free to comment below on your thoughts. Don't forget to hit the like button and even subscribe to the channel and I'll catch you all soon. Bye for now.